Hello friends, uh, today we will be seeing how to register self for uh, ARCID ID. So first we need to open the Google page. And uh, here we need a ID that is email address. Any email address like it is can be with the Gmail or Yahoo or and so on. And uh, so how to register? So ARCID. So, ARCID is an organization, non-profit, where you have you will be registered yourself and you will be like uh, getting an uh, ID which consists of 16 digits number and um, it is a open researcher and contributor ID. It is usually required uh, for the um, many journals whenever we will submit paper research paper for our publication like scopus index hindavi and so on there usually you need a very unique uh, id this one is arcade it's a, nowadays it's a, like a required registration so first we'll see uh, this is the site oscid.org so you are the for the first time you are like uh, browsing this particular site you have to register yourself otherwise already i signed so i will show you how to register so when you go for registration you will get this page to create your orchid id there are three steps involved that is first you have to enter your uh, name and uh, after that your email address and afterwards you have to verify the email address once uh, you will verify the email address your account will be activated so some kind of security notifications will be there and some visibility in terms whatever that will be there along with this we have to go through so here it is the first name last name and your primary email address again you have to type the second time the same primary email address which you want to give you can add the additional email addresses also and uh, you have anything you can go back otherwise you have to go for the next so we'll start with even though i have email uh, i have orchid id to show you uh, i'll be writing uh, some false information over here mm. an optional so your email address you cannot copy this one and paste it over here it will not accept you can check it so suppose you want to paste it you can't paste it so you have to retype it because it's to confirm any others so this is and if you want to add additional the importance is uh, sometimes it will help you to access So some error is there you can see here mirror it, yeah, it is wrong here but taking this one as the primary second one is showing error otherwise here i type it wrong so it's correct now now we will go to the next this is the first personal information then we are going to the next so any already existing names anything is there which you are you know i already have an id go back to sign in that is one possibility second one is this is showing with the name uh, mixi if anyone we accidentally forgot our registration and uh, it will help us to retry so here is none none of them are me continue with the registration even i told you mixi is the first name i entered so none of this so now what happened is in this space you have to give you a password 
and uh, it should be of eight uh, or more character and uh, you should give one letter or symbol that is one two three four or you can give like a uh, et flash slash dollar that is symbol and one letter or symbol this one eight or more character minimum one should have one letter or symbol should be there and letter means a b c d and symbol means uh, special like a uh, dollar sign and on and so on and one number it is you have to use your like numeric anyone so this should be the combination of your password should be so you have to give first password It's okay. I have given all the combinations, whatever it is. X. It is asked for. So I am going to put this one. So it is same. So no change. So if any error is there, it would have shown. And uh, please send me if you are interested to receive any kind of you know notifications or. Anything uh, related to Orchid, you may click it. Otherwise, once you have done with this, and you have to go for this, we we'll create. This is the one final visibility terms. So create your own Orchid ID. That one is. I don't want to register because I already told you I have my own. So the information here I'm showing is the false. This is the different icons you will be finding in your in your uh, page. So these are the, some of the things you have to put it as a consent private policy and also and uh, I consent my data processing and I am not Robert. You have to put it and go for registration. So I am not clicking over here. Now I am entering into the sign. Already I have like uh, I saved my username and password to this Google page. So my, this one you can do the sign over you sign in over here by clicking in this place or if you have any uh, your university id like suppose uh, in, at the rate of uog.edu.et or and so on whatever that one you can put it through this by clicking here suppose you are clicking this one it will ask you your name and continue but we are not interested over here so next is sign with you already have uh, another account like a google account any gmail account you can sign along with that also or if you have the facebook click. but anyways uh, we are directly signing into the email address that i used it to register for my orchid id and with this so i'm signing in so once it is done it will send you one link so these are the some of the things uh, orchid and details um, said so i don't want to spend more time on my personal site it's the public version so otherwise i can show you this is the orchid now id suppose if you use the google page you paste the orchid id it will take you to the person like you can see here, the public displayed related. So anybody once have the ID, they can browse the person's information, which is on the public platform that is on the Orchid, where you can view. Usually this particular ID is related to the academics. So that includes your qualifications, your uh, employment, and uh, your publications that is related to Scopus and all this will be like automatically it will be displayed so this is the public view so so it is important you can see a publication where a research uh, paper or a journal which is asking for the orchid suppose the vision so 
we are want to submit a research article in Hindavi. So There is some of the different uh, information that is present for the different journals that is available under the different uh, areas or disciplines. So, so we want to go into this and we would like to see how this orbit ID is mandated. So, Publish at the end of this, suppose. Publish the one, this is the different things. This is the sum of the thing, publishing policy. It means your, suppose we take one publication. So latest article suppose, see this is the article ID, is a link. So if you click this one, about this author, we get the details. So no information is, public information is not, uh, this author is not uh, open, is uh, or get ID for public view. So it depends like uh, suppose we go for so this is this uh, you want to open. this person is having one view that is this particular paper. So like this, it will tell you about this particular author and his publication. Now this. Thank you. Thank you for watching. And please like, share and subscribe.